All right. What we have here is stage six of our 2005 Harley Davidson Deuce build. This is all stuff that we do here at Cycle Solutions at shows, 35 shows across the country. You can also access this information on boxoflube.com. All right, so what we've done here is several steps. The first was to put NGK's Iridium spark plugs in. We compared a K&N air filter, which made a nice improvement to the, to the uh, Jet Screen Complete. This is a Jet Screen Complete that's assembled. Makes it work so well as the screen here, all right? It also has a pair of venting holes which depressurize the crankcase into the top of the throttle body. So after we installed that, we did some tuning using the Zippers Thundermax. Got a great air fuel ratio, a nice timing curve, bike runs superb. Bone stock, 52 horsepower, it's climbed all the way to 74. And the other key of this is our synthetic oil treatment with the K&N oil filter. Okay, as you can see, we've opened up the motor. Stage six in this build is going from the Harley Davidson stock chain drive cams to the SNS gear drives and push rods. We've got a display here that accurately demonstrates just how much friction and how much horsepower you lose. When you turn this, it takes every bit of effort that you got to move it. Reason being, the chains are tensioned by a tensioner both in the front and in the rear. They also use some fairly shoddy bearings in doing this. So, when we convert, as you see here, the motor over to a gear drive cam, it takes very little effort. You can spin it forward and backward, no problem. Bottom line, we used a 510 gear drive cam, a little bit more duration, a little bit more lift, complementing bearings, both in the cam case and the actual uh, oil um, the cam plate itself. Stock oil pump, and we used SNS quickie adjustable push rods. So when this is all done, we're going to put it back up on the dyno and we're going to graph it. We're just about ready to button it up. You can see the gear sets, both the cams, push rods, covers, seals, they've all been reinstalled. All right, we'll button it up, put some more oil back in it, put it back on the dyno and see what we got.